Hey everybody, welcome to this video. This is not a normal type of video I do, but I wanted to show people this new character creation process, which I encountered when creating alts recently that had nothing to do with trying to get a blazing lion from the new lure system, but it's different than the normal process, and a lot of people hadn't seen it yet, so I thought I'd try to record it and show people what it looks. Anyway, I just created this um, this account, and this is the first time logging in. Right away, it pops up with this choice of cat or dog. It doesn't even tell you why, but it just says, I mean, I guess, are you a dog person or a cat person? Uh, and that's, you know, the most existential question to all humanity, I suppose. So anyway, of course, we all know we're all cat people at heart. So let's choose that. And then, you know, confirm your choice. Of course, uh, I already told you I'm a cat person. So then, boom. Now this, uh, you know, I, I kind of animated sequence here. Uh, pay no attention to the avatar model. It was one of us free at the time. And you get this whole animated sequence where you wake up, you go outside, and boom, there's a pet egg waiting for you. Or the starter egg waiting for you. And that would typically be like, you know, five minutes into it, you would go to the nursery and get that. You're like, where the heck did this come from? Should I trust it? Should I bring it in? But obviously, you know, what are you going to do? Leave it out there. Uh, you see these, like, kind of, this kind of animation here, or this uh, bath icon. So right away, like before you do anything in the game, you're you're getting to you're uh, taking care of your pet's needs. So okay, but I'll give you a bath. Come here. I mean, you know, I would, younger I would show up at people's house sometimes and ask to use their showers. No lie, but that's a different story. Uh, so all right, well, bathe this thing. You can see the house pretty much still the same, actually. Uh, and then right way into the food. And, um, no, nah, I believe after that, it doesn't get thirsty. I think, uh, it actually then, yeah, so now it's tired, but, you know, we don't have, there's no crib anymore. There used to be a crib in here, but they kind of changed the layout of the default house, uh, most recently. So, then it says, hey, I want you to make me a crib. So, all right, come here. And then, boom, crib's right there, cost zero dollars. Uh, so, set it anywhere. And then... Time to make the cat. Should be the last task needed. And poof. Instant cat. No 50 50 luck of the draw. You know, you get to choose what pet you want to start with. Brings up the, uh, the, um, journal page here, which is something I never did. And, you know, a lot of people don't know about the journal until they're well, weeks or so into playing the game. So, uh, where do you go? Here's the X. So, boom, right done. Uh, and then I think now it starts to go into like the traditional. All right, let's find something to wear. Um, you know, my style is, and then, you know, that's kind of, I think from here on, it's just, uh, you know, it is Halloween at the time. You get your starter cap here, but, uh, and then I think from here on, the game is pretty much the same, but, you know, it's a little bit more fast of a uh, intro sequence before. It was very kind of drawn out of, it would say, hey, edit your house, but it's like, you don't really know what to do in the first day of editing your house. You're not going to go build something big, so, and then having to navigate you to the nursery to adopt the egg this way you know you're you're in you hatch your first pet and you're off and go into the races so that is the new kind of account sequence this is something that's only being done probably in an a b testing like they do a lot of things and um so i wouldn't expect to see it uh maybe for a while maybe they're gonna make some more tweaks to it who knows maybe they just scrap it all together then i don't know how they kind of get the feedback for this sort of thing but there you go. All right. Well, anyway, back to my normal type content. Uh, enjoy Halloween. I'm sure I'll be posting before then, but if not, have yourself a good Halloween. See ya.